Here's how you can win a bet every single time. Give someone the cards, ask them to shuffle, and they can really mix them up. Completely shuffled deck. Now, when you take the cards back, all you're going to do is take the top five cards, put them down on the table. You're going to cut the cards, take five more from the middle somewhere, put them down on the table, and finally cut the cards again and take five more cards. You're going to put them down next to it. So they just shuffled these, so these are all completely random cards. Get rid of the deck, and with the piles, you're going to ask them to pick one, anyone they want. Let's say they pick this one right here. They now pick these cards up, spread them out, and they're going to look at, and they're going to remember any one of the cards. So to make it simple, let's say they're remembering the Ace of Spades. Now, have them turn them face down and shuffle the cards and mix them up so they don't even know where their card is themselves, and they mix all these cards up. When they're finished, just have them drop them on any of the two piles. Doesn't matter. So the last pile, put that on top, and they're going to pick everything up just like this. Now, what you do is you turn around, she can't see, and you're going to ask them to deal the cards face up on the table and make five piles. So they do this, and they deal the cards out. Now remember, you can't see this because you'll turn around. But you're going to ask them to keep a lookout which pile their card is in. So they deal all the cards, all out on the table just like this, and you can see their card is right here. Now remember, you'll still turn around so you can't see. Ask them to pick up the pile with their card in and keep hold of it. Take all the other cards and just get rid of them. So now, you turn around and you're going to bet them. You're going to bet them that you're going to take these cards, put them behind your back, and you're going to find their card. Now, obviously, they're not going to believe you. Sounds impossible, but check this out. You take the cards, put them behind your back, and you just come forward, take one, and say, I don't think it's that. With your other hand, take another one and say, you don't think it's that. And now you're left holding just one card. They name their card. They say it's the Ace of Spades. And look, every single time, this is going to be their card without fail. Now let's learn this. It's so good, I've won so much money with this. So they really can shuffle the cards and there really is 15 random cards on the table. So what they do is when they pick a pile and they look at it, no matter which one they choose, this will always work. So let's say they choose the Ace of Clubs this time. They mix these up and they mix them up so it's completely lost and no one knows where it is. It doesn't matter because when they put this pile on top of another pile and they take the last pile and put it on top, that stack of five cards is one in five chance it's going to be theirs is in the middle. So when they take these cards now and they deal them face up on the table, look, when you come to the second row, every single time one of those five is going to go in the second row just like this. So always their card is going to be here. So you deal the cards out just like this and no matter which pile they pick up, so they pick up this pile, their card is always going to be the middle. So they turn them over and hold them and get rid of the cards. And when you make the bet and you put these behind your back, use this hand, just take the top card and bring that forward and say it's not that then hold the cards take the bottom card with the other hand bring that forward and get rid of that and you're going to be left holding one card this was the middle card and every single time this is going to be that card that they were thinking of even though they never said it out loud